Police in Nakuru suspect that there could be a child trafficking syndicate following the disappearance of over 20 children in the past one month. The latest incident involving a four-year-old boy, Patrick Ocheng, who was lured away by a stranger who offered to buy him french fries and soda. Marianne Nyambura reports from Nakuru. Family of Francis Ocheng is in agony since their four-year-old son went missing on Sunday, October 14th. As days turn into months, those emotions are deepening. All they know is that it had happened so fast. At the time of the incident, four-year-old Patrick was in the company of his three sisters on their way to Saints Camp Church when a middle-aged woman approached them. The stranger promised the boy fries and a bottle of soda and in the process whisked him away. Upon realizing that the child was missing, the family reported the matter to Rhonda, Bondeni and Central Police Stations, but the search for the missing boy is yet to bear fruit. The family, though, still hopeful of finding their missing son, are questioning the motive since the abductors are yet to ask for ransom. Mengi yako machaches, mengi sana yu sandi. Nilikuwa nikiingia nikisema, maybe yu mama kama akukua na niambaya, amenunua kama niyo chips na akachilia mtoto. Sana nilikuwa na hope sa yu nikimtafuta. Ni mtoto wa shule wa baby. Hata imtiani yenye meisha ajafanya. Juyo 14th Sunday, alafu Monday ndo walikuwa anze mtiani yao. But it's not only Patrick's case that is sending an amber alert to the police. This past month alone, there have been reports of child abductions, police putting the figure at over 20. And the trend is a major concern in this neighborhood of Rwanda. Most of them, they disappear on Sundays or even Saturdays. And maybe these are the times when their parents are in either SDA church or in other churches on Sunday. Patrick Otieno Ocheng was last seen here. One month on, the family is in anguish, the pain of losing their son weighing down on them. Miriam Nyambura, Citizen TV, Nakuru County.